Hey guys, so this might be one of the most spontaneous things I've done in a hot minute. I'm currently on a three hour journey to Bath. It's 6 a.m. and yeah, join me. <laughs> Right, as you can see, I'm surrounded by fields and I'm probably questioning my life choices here uh, <laughs> um, because I did book this ticket at about 10 p.m. I started my journey at about 6 a.m. So, yeah, that's me. <laughs> so this is the only time I've actually had to record something that looked like a camera from here, I swear to God. Um, so I'm currently in the hotel. Well, it's actually a guest house, it's not a hotel, but it's beautiful. Like, I can only give you a glimpse, that's um, en suite. Um, and I'm obviously sat in front of a mirror, it's me. <laughs> um, it's genuinely so nice. And they upgraded me to a better room because I'm guessing there's no one in the place. Um, I'm currently gonna go to a walking tour which is at 2.30, it's currently 1.46. <laughs> so it's only a 14 minute walk to um, where I'm going right now. So yeah, I'm gonna be on my way and then tomorrow I'm gonna visit the Roman Baths. It's genuinely so stunning here, it's raining. It, it literally is pissing it down. Well, it's not pissing it down, but it's, it's, you know, it's like musty dusty and, you know, all the beautiful brown creamish color that Bath has, like, you know, all the houses are like um, kind of yellow. I don't know how to explain it. Um, you can't get that and they just all look dirty. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna be off now, bye. The tour guide actually lived there. I think he was a local resident and he showed us the ins and outs of Bath and it was brilliant. I love little fun facts about random things as you'll hear later in this video, <laughs> but it was so nice and I really do recommend this. This is a films and books. This is no big surprise to you and the times if you've never been to Bath before. So I've just come back, I look a bit rough, I'm so tired. I've averaged about 12,000 steps today, which is quite good actually considering how much i walked um which is apparently not that much um yeah i'm literally about to demolish my um subway um the tour was absolutely wonderful um i don't remember the tour guide's name but he was so lovely um didn't talk to him because it was quite a big group there was like it was like 12 of us maybe maybe i wouldn't say 15 there was like 12 of us um and it was splendid like i i've found out so much about bath like i have like random fun facts in my head like the whole shell tiles and the fact that every building has five floors um and literally the amount like the amount of baby facts i have in my head like and i'm already like a knows random facts about random shit but now i'm even more so knows random things about random shit and yeah i've had such a lovely day it's the weather really like blessed me considering it said it was gonna rain 80 percent um it was like drizzling all day um but then i managed to get a lovely like cloud like it was like you can tell the sun was setting because i didn't get a sunrise this morning um especially i was on the train and it was just like, fog fog everywhere it was so misty and so dull and like, honestly i wasn't in the mood but now that i'm here i'm like oh my god like um but yeah it's currently like six i think so it's literally i'm about to eat and i might go downstairs to check out the little um um cafe i guess and um, so yeah i'm gonna go check that out and see what it is just so i don't have anxiety tomorrow when i have to go there um by myself because once again i am traveling by myself which is like my first time ever and i'm here for it so yeah um i'm hoping i don't have bits of granola stuck in my teeth that would be really embarrassing um so it's morning i've just had breakfast that's why i'm out of breath i have like a food baby going the breakfast was lovely the customer service was even better um th there there was one waitress and she was really nice and obviously this is my first time um i guess staying in a hotel by myself or even well this isn't a hotel i need to stop saying it's a hotel but it feels like a hotel so i'm just gonna call it a hotel um and yeah so i, I had a breakfast included and I didn't go down yesterday to see how it looks and stuff so that I would reduce anxiety this morning. So I walked down and I'm just there like, <laughs> it was nice. Um, 
and the food was so good like mm. basically my plan for today is go to the roman baths at 12 45. i mean admission is from 12 45 to 1 so but i'm gonna try to get there earlier um, but yeah it's been so nice also my hair's wet i actually went to breakfast with wet hair because i was like oh my god i don't want to miss my breakfast and like it was like it was even more wet than this this is just damp now but it's kind of embarrassing but it is what it is i'm hot <laughs> I know you can't hear me right now, but I got strangers to take a picture of me and um, they took a few. My hair looked really messy in the first one. There's like constructions going on right now, so, but I'm here. I don't think I can actually explain how beautiful the Roman baths were. I mean, it was really something and I did go when it was rusty, musty, as I mentioned before in the video, but it, it was stunning. Um, and it's something you have to see at least once in your life. Um, it did have like a little museum downstairs um, and it was really interesting to walk through and see how it might have looked a long time ago. I've just managed to get a moment to actually record something. Um, it's brilliant! So here I'm coming towards the end of my journey and well the end of the video. I got to experience Bath in all different lightings and all different aspects. I got everything I wanted out of this trip and considering I only went for well, two days and a night, I truly got to experience every side of Bath. Um, really recommend maybe not impulsively like myself but regardless thank you for watching and see ya